Good afternoon, Art Buddies. This is Paint Whirly, and this morning I did my live stream and um, unbundled a uh, eco dye that I did, and um, I prepared one during the stream, so I boiled that this afternoon, and I'm going to undo that for you in case you want to have a look. Now, my husband may forget that I'm recording, so I might be interrupted. Not sure. I also um, went out to the garden and picked a few leaves and added them to a second bundle. So let's see. These were the purpley zinnias that had white in them. And I don't know if you noticed, but my wrappings here got a lot dingier. They were a pretty yellow color because in the first boil, I had onion skins. But I didn't have any more skins to add. So these have been sitting a little while. Nice and cool to the touch. My goodness, it doesn't look like I got any color. You'll remember earlier, if you were with me live or if you watched the replay, I got some nice yellowy tints to the paper. Some bright yellow and some orangey yellow. Same paper. I see almost no color. Maybe a little yellow. We didn't put any yellow in this batch. Well, this is a disappointment. They smell very woodsy. This was the um, base of the flower that I'd plucked all the petals off of. So that inside part there, I guess where the pollen is, gave me some color. But there's no, no purple, no red, no blue. There's a little bit of blue up there. I didn't have any petals up there. Well, that's pilly. That's pilly, pilly. Well, earlier I had trouble staying connected, and I think it's because I threw all this stuff on my um, keyboard. So I'm not going to do that right now. I'm going to put them off to the side. Now, this one we buried another little. partial flower. I cut some of them in half. Oh, this was the little little one that just was bent off to the side. Just made a little yellow spot. No, really no print. Just gave off some color. Okay, what did I do here? Petals, no color, no color. I think that yellow was from what we took off in the previous page. I don't remember putting a leaf in this bundle, but there it is, which it did absolutely nothing. No color and no markings. I guess you're glad you tuned in for this. Threw in some of these maple whirly gigs. They gave no color. That was a bust. This is one we cut in half. Nothing. Looks like two eyeballs from a monster. Bah, monster mash. Shooty tooties, shooty tooties. Wow, those petals were a bust. A bust. This left behind some debris. Looks like uh, cheese powder. 
that you'd put on popcorn. I'll be darn. Nothing. Really, nothing. I think we've got another little. I keep wanting to call them buds, but it's not a bud. The remains of a flower. I don't know what you call that bottom part. You know where all the petals are connected. A little bit. Looks like pollen. No impression. No print. Barely any color. Okay, so I guess I'll give you your money back for watching that part of the video. Now, these are leaves. I hope I got a little something. I picked some ferns. I picked some hydrangea leaves. Um, some zinnia leaves. And I think some pinky winky leaves. Pinky winky is a variety of a hydrangea. So there's the remains of the fern. And I use the um, composition paper, which is kind of deteriorating. Hmm. I don't know if I let it dry, if I would salvage it. Oh, that tour. Oh my gosh, nothing. Some yellow staining. I wonder if it matters if you start with dry paper. This paper was damp when I loaded. Oh, look, there's a petal. This is a geranium leaf, I think. Geranium or begonia? Looks like a lily pad. Nothing. No print. Nothing. Here's another one. In here. Well, that looks pretty that way. No print. It's a little bit of an impression, but no print. And this paper is not holding up at all. That maybe that's because I started with it damp. I don't know. I'll have to ask Jackal and she might know. Wow. This is a super bust. No leaves in there. This is a hydrangea leaf. Oh, there's a little tiny print there. I don't think you can see it. Little tiny. Nothing to write home about, that's for sure. Oh my goodness.
furnace. I think I'm going to iron a couple of these. See if anything pops, but I doubt it. This has got a little tiny print. Let me see if I can get this. Looks like collard greens. I wonder if spinach would do anything. Hmm. That's really oh, they all fell off. <laughs> Wonder if I hit that with an iron. What will happen? Might as well try to find out because there's nothing else going on in this video. Going from bad to worse. Look, there's nothing. This is nothing. Nothing, honey. Nothing, honey. Gave off a little bit of yellow. I don't see any any print. But you can see in the leaves all kinds of definition. But not on that paper. All right, so that's the fabric I wrapped it in. It's all my sludge over there. Let's see, is my iron? I plugged this in or did I take it out? I think it might be out. Just humor me a minute. Just humor me, please. Well, if I was a working girl, I think you'd be saying, don't quit your day job, Laura. I was trying to find a piece of this ShamWell where the wax, I think that's all waxy there. Oh, look, I didn't unveil one. Hold on. Oh, I was thinking that was underneath. Very tiny, very tiny bit there. Oh, that heats up pretty quick. Okay. This is very wet. So I'm just kind of hovering over the paper. Because it's so flimsy to begin with. Because if it's real thin and you rub down on it too quickly when it's wet, it just kind of pills. So I've got two sheets here. Still picking up some wax.
Maybe I should down, put down that other fabric. That might be a good idea. Let's see. Let's try that. I don't think the wax is going to come through that. This is a huge disappointment. Your iron can stick. Look, it still looks like it's coming through. Hey, maybe it's on the iron. Doesn't look like there's wax on there. Mm. Well, I didn't measure my vinegar. I think I probably, it was a smaller um, amount of water. Um... I think I put in a quarter cup of vinegar. Now this one still has the leaf attached. Oh, look, it's still got... We got nothing, honey. I'm still my it seems like my connection's coming in and out. Very little bit here. a little tiny bit of a leaf image not much well that was a bust at least the Phillies one This looks like I dropped some yellow paint in a couple of spots. Waste the paper. Well, there you have it. An epic fail. Now you know I'm going to have to try this again. That's so sad. I think 
I might have a video on my channel when I first started doing this. And the ones that turned out, you know, real dark. I'll have to go look. Maybe I could list that. This is terrible. This page still has fern leaves stuck to it. It's easier to get the leaves off when you put heat to it. That's a bonus tip. Uh, <clears throat> oh my goodness. All right, our buddies. That's it for this. Sorry for the disappointment. Hope your afternoon went better than this. <laughs> I'll see you next time. Bye for now.